What is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Now it might look different because I'm actually filming on, well, a different camera. And it's actually better quality if you didn't know this already. I mean, just look at look at how good this quality is. And now it's actually, it's not my camera, okay? It's not a new camera. It's not mine. It's actually, well, my mom's. But, um, well, I don't know. Today's just going to be like a little vlog because I haven't done one in forever. And you guys haven't seen, like, me in a while because I haven't been uploading that much in December like I thought I would be. But, um... Yeah, but let's take you guys off the tripod and well, I don't really know. We're just gonna like do something that I haven't done in a while, which is just like vlog, I guess. I don't really know. But this is actually the camera I'm filming on. You know what I mean? I, I don't know why it's like so dark. Hold on, can I fix that? Oh, I can. All right, let's go. All right. Okay, there we go. So I, I just haven't been like, well, I have like a couple videos that I've made, I just didn't upload them and I haven't made thumbnails for them yet, so well, I don't know. It's just I don't know. it's just really weird right now. I just I don't know how to explain it. But well, I'm gonna start uploading more and um well it's actually almost been a year. A year. You've heard that right. One year since I've been making YouTube videos on this channel. Now I made this channel like in July of 2019, um, I, that's when I created the channel, and I posted my first video on here on January 1st, 2020. I think today's like the 23rd. It's almost Christmas, guys. It's almost Christmas. And, um, yeah, so I'm just going to give you guys a little update around my house and whatever. I mean, you know, you got this guy right here. Just, he's been there, you know. And the reason why I am actually inside is because, well, look at that tree. It's windy. Even more windy. And it's, it's actually been raining off and on. But, I mean, well, there is presence under the tree. You already know. Yeah. But, I actually did upload already today. Um, except probably the last video I uploaded, I think, maybe, I don't really know, honestly. But it's just a really, really crappy day out today. So, that's the only reason why I'm not outside, or else I'd probably be outside. Alright guys, so I'm actually back on my camera, and it's actually Christmas Day, so hey, Merry Christmas to you guys. But, um, well, it's actually snowing out right now, if you can see that. Yeah. But, um, I am done opening up my gifts for 2020 Christmas, so, um, it's pretty awesome actually I got some cool stuff and I got a little something something so um, I'll probably show you guys that in this video honestly but um well it was a heck of a Christmas and remember it's for giving not getting so I mean getting is just like a well just a bonus I guess but it's actually giving and seeing people's reactions and everything but the main part about Christmas actually is Jesus so if you don't know um, Christmas Day is actually well Jesus' birthday, and so it's the day he was born, the day he was brought into this earth, he is actually the reason why a lot of us are here, so just remember that, think about that, and just don't think about it for getting gifts, just just remember like the true reason of Christmas, okay? But, what I did get, I got some pretty cool stuff actually, I got a stinking rangefinder in here, I got some cars and stuff, got some clothes, got some duct tape in case you need it, but uh, oh, 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 hey, oh, <laughs> You guys didn't need to see that. But, um, yeah. Actually, you can. It's it's some arrows. And what goes with arrows? Well, a bow. So, yes, I got a bow. And, um, it's pretty cool. And, um, well, I'll just go show you guys real quick. So, here we go. Okay, I'm back. I ran downstairs, grabbed it, brought it back up here. So, before I show you the bow, well, here it is. Okay, so here's the bow. You know, it's pretty... Pretty cool, I guess. It is a Creative XP. Yeah, that's all I really know about it, honestly. I think it was on Amazon for about $250. It's got a five pin sight, as you can see right here. Huh? Show you guys real quick. Got five pin sight right there. It's got the arrow holder release. Wait, what is it called again? The arrow holder. I think is what it is. And then I got my release right here. Now this actually came with it. It's released right here, so basically what it is is get a little trigger thing, got a loop, basically put it on like this, 
pull it back so you can pull back the string. Yeah. Now this is not sighted anything. I haven't shot it yet. So I'll probably do that in a future video maybe. But um well, it's pretty cool. Me and my brother put it up together. And it's got peep sight. And um yeah, it's pretty cool. And it actually like it's got a flashlight on it. Can you guys see that? I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Yeah. It's got like a flashlight on it, so like if you do that at night, which I don't know why you would, but I, oh well. But also, I did get something separate with the bow. Can you guess what it is? Boom, baby! It's a bow target. It's a Hurricane 425, I guess. I don't really know, but it got like the target side right there, and I got some deer vitals right there. So that's pretty cool. I'm sure you guys probably want to see me pull back the bow, but um, well, it's it's I don't know what the pounds is at right now, honestly. I have no clue what the poundage is at. So, for your guys' entertainment, I'm going to pull back the bow, or at least attempt, because, well, I was doing it earlier a lot, so my arms are kind of tired, and, um, well, yeah, so basically this is what the release does, like, you put it on your wrist, and you got the trigger thingy, and then you go like this. Now, I will say, my face is going to be like, <laughs> Because it's really hard to pull back, pull back actually. Okay, so now this is on there so I can pull back with this, as you can see. So, here we go. There we go. It is really hard. So, I mean, hey, here it is, right here. You can see that. I'm not going to let it go because, well, you don't dry fire a bow. Because that's just not good, I guess. Now... The arrows, I'll pull them out real quick. So this is the arrows. Got the, uh, what you would call it? The knock on there. Got that knock. It's not a loom knock, but got the feathers right there. And then you got the field tip right there, which is for like practice shooting. Now I can get broadheads for like deer hunting or whatever, but yeah, but this is the field tip right here. Hold up. You see that? Yeah, there's the field tip. has a little tiny sharp point on it so I can insert into the target and then I took it off the arrow. So now this is just a plain old arrow. I'm trying to keep this like nice shape because I don't really know how long this is going to last me. So, But I'm going to try and keep it well. And I might buy a case for it. I'm not sure. But the case is like $20 on Amazon. So it's a hard case so I might get that. People don't understand how hard it is to actually pull back a bow. Cause like I've done it before and it's it's it gives you a little sweat going and it's like I don't know you just have to do it a bunch or like try and do it to know what it's like it's it's weird because you don't use the muscle that much and I'm using this as a pointer. But I hope you guys have a merry Christmas and um, well I don't really know how long this video is gonna be or like what I'm gonna be doing in it but um, yeah I'm actually just gonna show you guys like. Me pulling it back again because, well, two times wouldn't hurt, you know what I'm saying? So, here it is. Just go like this. Clip it on the little loop. There we go. Alright, here we go. There we go. See how much easier that is? And also, I can pull it back left handed because, if you didn't know, I'm a righty. And, um, well, I can pull it back left handed. I tried it. I've done it a whole lot, actually. Yeah, I'm going to show you guys me pulling it back left-handed. And yes, this is a right-handed bow, so... I'm not actually going to shoot left-handed. I'm just pulling it back. So, here we go. Ah, there we go. It's not that bad. So, I mean, as you guys know, it's a bow, and here's an arrow. So, you're probably thinking, have you even, like, shot it? No, I haven't. But... I am maybe tomorrow, so yeah, but I'll show you guys what it looks like with an arrow in the arrow holder. So basically, what you do, this is the knock on it at the end, so you put this in between the little D-loop right there, wait for it to click, alright, so now it's in there good, and then you put through this little thing like the arrow holder right there. You can see that. It's like that. 
This is me pulling back with an arrow in it. And don't try this at home, okay? So, this is what it looks like. Yeah, pretty cool, I guess. With an arrow in it. I think this is like my third time doing this with the arrow in it because I just want to be safe, you know? Because I'd hate for it, like, and what I am doing is when I pull it back, I do point it at the target in case anything does happen. So, you never know. And also, the link to my bow and everything will be in the top of the description. So, go check it out, you know. And, um, well, yeah, you can look at it. And it's on Amazon, so, pretty cool, I guess. Okay, guys, so it is actually the next day, and I actually just filmed another video, and I cited it in. So, right now, it's doing good. The pins are at... 10 yards, 20 yards, 25, 30, and 40. So that's are my pins, and I got five pins. So well, all that's sighted in, and so I'll show you guys a little clip of me shooting it. So as you can see, pretty cool, I guess. I don't really know. <laughs> but that is actually going to wrap it up for this video anyway. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed another video. And if you're not already, go to the subscribe button. Leave us on the turn your post into carries. You can follow me on Instagram. If you want some more videos like this, just comment down below. And that's basically it for this video. So, and until next time, peace out, buds.